morning. We have left the canals for the day and we are in... Belgium! Because <laughs> it's just like a two and a half hour ride from Amsterdam and I haven't ticked off many new countries on this trip so this is kind of a way to tick off That's the country. That's right. <laughs> Lily and I looked at each other yesterday and we said, hey, uh, would you ever go to Belgium? He was like, yeah. You want to go to Belgium tomorrow? <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> Our goal today is to knock off the four famous foods of Belgium, which is waffles, chocolates, french fries, and then finally, and then finally, really good Belgian beer. We're gonna do it, we're gonna have fun, and experience Belgium, which is so beautiful. Alright, Lily's first Belgian waffle. I'm in Belgium. Yeah, we did good. <laughs> first stop, waffles done. Lily, review, rating? 10 out of 10. They were crispy, they were delicious, the chocolate was lovely. The atmosphere was so nice, 10 out of 10. Honestly, it was beautiful. It was so tasty. I love a crispy waffle. I don't even really like sweet desserts, and we did it. So, so far, Belgium, or at least Brussels, feels very Parisian. Um, good and the bad. There's like trash everywhere. <laughs> Um, but it's also very pretty and like beautifully decorated for Christmas and people are speaking French so obviously that makes it feel kind of like you're in France. Good. Wow, Belgium. You are beautiful. beautiful. This is, I believe, the palace? It is, yes. Wow. It's, they go all out for Christmas here. You have a real Christmas tree, which I love. Our city center replaced it with a fake one and I've never kind of gotten over it. And then I love that they take Christmas really seriously here, like the religious aspect, because you have a whole nativity scene, like life size. Let's go take a look. Apparently Belgium is also famous for its peeing statues. I know. <laughs> Piss statues, as Lily said. So we're gonna go to the peeing dog statue. Oh, and just like that we found one of them. It's not a dog. Might need to censor this. <laughs> Well, boom, just like that, we got a bonus pisser. Let's go to the other pisser, huh? Pisser. <laughs> a weird thing to take a photo of. Okay, we found it. It's, it's uh... It's head cynic. Where is it what? <laughs> <laughs> so if you guys are wondering, like me, why there's a dog peeing statue, it's because a few years ago, a dog called the mud or head cynic was struck right here, breaking both of his legs. Don't know what happened to him, but they made a statue, so. No, 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 the statue was struck. Oh, the statue was struck in both the legs. It shows how he listens to me. No, the statue was struck and then they reconstructed it. And this is meant to represent the Belgian people. I don't know how, but. So now we're heading to the Banksy Museum because we've done a lot of modern art museums. We've done history museums, we've done art galleries, but this is something different and you can only find it in Brussels, so why not? We're here. Well, that was great. But now we gotta get back to our mission, which is the four Belgian foods. We got one down. Now let's knock out two. We're gonna do fancy fries. Fancy fries and some beer. Yeah, I was Ooh. gonna add 
Um, the museum was pretty cool. It's basically they what they do is like recreate kind of Banksy art that's around the world. And they also did have some original prints of it, so that was pretty cool to see. And honestly, it's kind of hilarious that you pay to go there when he's so like anti-capitalist. Then you, there's also a merch shop at the end of it, which is... Yeah, I don't think he's associated with it. <laughs> which is ironic. <laughs> Fries. The Belgian way? This is called the Turkish Delight, so I don't know. We're at a super fancy fry place. It's essentially poutine on crack. Let's try this out. It looks so good. Babe, these are perfect fries you need to try. Hitting on 10? Eight, just because the basil is a little bit different. I'm not sure how I feel about it, but the fry, ten out of ten. So I figured out why it's called the Turkish delight. It's essentially a kebab deconstructed. It is absolutely delicious. Ten out of ten, for real. And of course, when in Belgium, you have the Stella. We're going to get another beer after this somewhere else, but for Stella in Belgium. All of these are sauce dispensers. Oh my. Do I just do a little bit? Do I do like a corner? Yeah, I think you do corners. Okay, good to know. Oh my gosh. Okay, fries were a big, big win. Now we got to go knock off another one. Belgian chocolate. <laughs> so we just stopped at Nehaus. Nehaus, I'm butchering that, but they originally invented the praline style of chocolate. So we picked up some of their most popular ones and we're gonna try them out. That is decadent. Has a nice, I think this one has nougat. Really nice quality of dark chocolate. That salt. Mm. I hate to tell you all, but I'm actually not the biggest chocolate fan. Boo, oh, I know. Okay, original. Delightful crunch. Coffee flavor, which I'm a fan of. Hmm, very tasty, surprising. I like it. Time has passed. We went to a gallery, the old masters. Yeah, the it's like the the Belgian art gallery, but there, it's like com, it's comprised of different ones. But we went to see the old masters, and it was amazing. So amazing. One more thing left to do before we leave. Beer. Beer. not like the biggest place you've ever seen in your life. The Delirium is here. This is direct source from the Delirium Brewery. I got the dark ale, it's my favorite. Lily, the raspberry ale. Ooh, that looks pretty. All right, so we're here at the Delirium Cafe, which holds the Guinness World Record for the most amount of available beers for trying at 2,005 beers. I hope they have Guinness. <laughs> what? Oh! Belgium, beer capital. Who knew they had the Guinness World Record? Makes sense. So quick shout out to my cousin Will, who Delirium is his favorite beer. I don't know if you've been to Belgium though, so might have beat you to this one. Oh, it smells like raspberry. Mm. I love that. What nice! Honestly, I couldn't think of a better way to cap off our day here in Brussels. It has been an amazing time. We love Belgium. Mm -hmm. Super fun. Cheers. I'm leaving with chocolate in my pockets. One second. Oh, hold on. She's got chocolate. We're not done yet. I got chocolate in my pockets. I love Belgium. Belgium. The land of chocolate and beer. Cheers. 
See you in the next one.